sea level rise may be higher than previously predicted. During a European Geosciences Union conference just last month, scientists predicted that melting ice sheets and warming ocean water could raise sea levels by as much as 1.5 meters by the end of this century. This forecast is three times higher than reported by the United Nations Intergovernmental Panel on Climate Change, or IPCC, last year. These findings have raised the concern of both scientists and governments of coastal and island nations, which are the most vulnerable. Dr. Benjamin uh, Fang Chao is the dean of the uh, Earth Science uh, Institute uh, at the National Central University in Formosa, or Taiwan. One of the um, major consequences of uh, global warming is the rise of rising of sea level. This is truly a global problem because uh, uh, you know, a major part of our civilization actually resides uh, in uh, you know just uh, a few meters above sea level. So any uh, you know, even small amount of sea level rise over time uh, will have a great impact on, on world uh, you know, economics and uh, human livelihood. As an island country, Taiwan uh, should, uh, and of course it is, very uh, conscientious about, about this problem. Based on the latest analysis conducted by a joint British-Finnish team, sea levels over the past 2,000 years have been stable. Measurements indicate a rise of only 2 centimeters in the 18th century and 6 centimeters in the 19th century, but then a sudden and alarming 19 centimeters or over half a foot within the past century. This is most likely due to the melting glacial ice sheets. To climatologists, these small numbers are significant, with likely more complex implications that are understood so far. It's very serious because we don't know how to predict uh, the future whether the, uh, the, the uh, sea level rise will become catastrophic. Uh, that will be uh, something beyond our uh, ability to, to predict. And also, um, uh, the, the, the sea level is actually a, a thermometer uh, reflecting the, the seriousness of, uh, of global warming. So in that regards, the, uh, the sea level uh, rise problem should be closely monitored. Thank you, Dr. Chow and all scientists who are diligently updating and sharing this information about global warming. May we continue to act quickly as our knowledge of the climate system expands in order to save precious lives.